Boom. Yay. Dixling. Hey. Boom. Hello there. And welcome to my new Let's Play. Let's watch this little cutscene here. Big spaceship. Green spaceship. BSL. I have no idea what that sounds. Ooh. 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 It's Samus. Yes. So what now? Yeah, the, the game is warning. Um, yeah, the game just instantly started with this cutscene. So I, I guess we'll start. Addressing this, and then I will. What? Metroid Fusion. This is 2002, huh? I thought it. Uh, well, language. Yeah, it's it's good in English. Uh, so yeah, to start with, uh, this game uh, was requested uh, by one of you guys. So I'm gonna play it now, uh, but. I'm only gonna play it on weekdays. Uh, I, I can say that right now. So it will be Monday to Friday. It will be this game. And. Uh, ah, damn it. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Uh, I guess I'll t keep doing this a little bit. Yeah, and then uh, Saturday and Sunday, there will be something else. You will just have to see. Uh, but yeah, I'm playing Metro Fusion, and I can begin by saying I've never played a Metro game before at all, so I, I have no experience with Metroid whatsoever. Uh, the only, the closest I've come to playing a Metroid game is when I watched Game Grumps playing, I think it was Super Metroid a few years ago. That's the closest I've come to, <coughs> to uh, playing a Metroid game, and like, the other things that I do know about series mostly come from Smash Brothers. So... Yeah, that's what I can say. Let's start. Oh, I get to pick a file. Ooh. So you can pick, like, sound from headphones or the Game Boy Advance. <laughs> it sounds better on this one. It's louder. It's louder in my ears. So file A, I guess. Start. Sure. been assigned to watch I'd been assigned to watch over Biologic's research team so I once again found myself on the surface of SR388 I do recognize the music oh well there what's brain frog Morph? It was there that I was attacked by a life form I had never encountered before. Oh. Oh, and this. It was only later that I learned the identity of my attacker. The parasitic organism we now know as X. <laughs> uh. If. If it's known as X, X is usually the, the thing you. Is, use for something that is unknown, so <laughs> doesn't really help. Unaware of my condition, I was returning to the station. When disaster struck. Oh, that was the cutscene. Once the X had infested my central nervous system, I lost consciousness and my ship drifted into an asteroid belt. Oh, that's what happened. Okay. That's what this is. And those were those the two guys following me in the short. The ship's emergency systems automatically ejected the escape pod before impact. Biologics vessel. Oh, the BSL. B is probably for biologic. SL, I'm not sure. Biologics vessel recovered it and transported me to Galactic Federation HQ. However, during the journey, the X multiplied within me. 
corrupting large areas of my power suit. It then came to light that the organic components of my power suit had become so in integrated with my system that, that it could not be removed while I was unconscious. Large portions of my suit had to be surgically removed, dramatically altering my physical appearance. However, the X in my central nervous system were too embedded to be removed safely. I was given a minimal chance of surviving. Then, someone found a cure. They proposed using a Metroid cell to make an anti-X anti vaccine. It seems that the Federation had managed to preserve a cell culture from the last infant Metroid from SR388. The serum was prepared and injected without delay. The X parasites were immediately and completely destroyed. But what's gonna happen? Okay, they shrink away. Oh, the suit is blue now. Or teal. As for me, one life ended, yet I survived, reborn, as something different. Pondering this fact, I realize I owe the Metroid Hatchling my life twice over. Oh yeah. Like the ending of Super Metroid, I remember when you was play that, what happened. We'll soon be arriving at the BSL research station. I must prepare for docking. The ship's computer has notified me of our approach to the biological space labs. Biological Space Labs, or BSL, Research Station. During my surgery, the research... Re is it research or research? Oh, wait, it's a research team, but you do research. That, that, is that correct? I don't know. But the research team sent the last batch of creatures we captured there, as well as the infected pieces of my power suit. After regaining consciousness, I learned that an unexplained explosion rocked the station. For some reason, this awoke a nameless fear in my heart, and now I am being sent there to investigate. My mission on the BSL station will be overseen by my new ship's computer. Following the commands of this blunt, computerized CO is something I have to bear, as it was a condition of my taking the ship. For someone who disliked, dislikes taking orders, this is the second time I've found myself having to do so. It makes me recall my or other CO. What does CO mean? Oh, so that's the station. Okay. <laughs> it looked weird for being a planet. Of course it does. <coughs> oh, so this new ship is purple. So. Oh, this is the map. There's been an explosion in the in the quarantine bay. Might as well wait until it spells out everything. Otherwise, it will sound weird if I like one word at a time. The bay currently stores capsules containing recent samples from SR388, as well as parts of your suit infected by the X parasites. The cause of the explosion is as yet unclear. Investigate. Oh, is this like the computer talking to me? The quarantine bay is here. Move quickly and quietly. You are still unable to use most of your latent abilities. Don't forget that Samus, stop at the navigation room on the way. Uplink from there. Is your objective clear? Yeah, sure. 
now go to the quarantine bay. Wasn't I supposed to go to the that room he just mentioned? Not the quarantine. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. So can't go this. Way. Okay, aim up. Duck. Oh, oh, that's kind of cool. It stays in duck, so you can. Oh, until you do up. Or try to start running, okay. And that's shoot. That's jump. What's this? Oh, it's diag diagonal. Oh, diagonal up and down. Whoa, whoa. And what does this do? Oh, whoa. <laughs> Not supposed to do that. Uh, this button doesn't do anything. Hmm. Like the R button is supposed to be. Where, 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 start? Okay, oh, so this is the map. Oh, here is what the R button does. I can check my status. I'm not sure what it, it anything means. Sleep. Engage sleep mode. No, 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 no. So where am I? Okay, I'm down there. So left up and then just keep going left, I guess. And was it this button for or this? No. Okay, so I guess select button or whatever it is doesn't. Ooh. Oh, yeah, right. It's very silent. Is there no music here? Isn't... Oh, oh. 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 That, okay. I'm a little bit weirded out. Whoop. Nope, that doesn't work. Hey. Oh, so if I just tap the jump button... No, wait. Um, oh, that's cool. If I just tap the jump button, it's a small jump. If I hold it down, it's a high jump. Hmm. So yeah, as I said, I have no prior experience with these types of games. So I don't know what what to expect, <laughs> except the things I've seen when Game Grumps played Super Metroid. So yeah, all I know is it's a side scroller and you have a big map. I believe. Like, the genre is called Metroidvania. Oh. Oh, that's the platform. Okay, but I'm supposed to go in here. Navigation. Oh, yeah, navigation room. This was where I was supposed to... Okay, so I'm supposed to go here first and then through... Okay. So, is th what does this do? The quarantine bay is ahead. Bioscience are confirmed. Be careful. Yeah. I will be. I will try. I need to... Oh, music, finally. A little bit creepy music. That door is closed. Where do we go? Nowhere to go but up. Can I do the roll thingy? Or do you have to learn that? I guess you have to learn it. You'll have to excuse if I'm if I'm a little if the commentary is a bit lackluster now in the beginning of this series because I need to learn how to control the the controls of the game and I need to get used to the type of game. Quarantine Bay. Like I just finished Rest and the Clank where there are voice acting in it, so I don't need to talk as much as I do in this. Hip. Oh. Oh, 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 whoa, oh, oh. Pew! No, 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 no! There we Ah, damn it, it's already gone. Ha, ha! Okay, takes more than one hit. Come on! Oh, it's one of those that we saw, okay. It just looked... It escaped. That's not good. The X parasite. Where did it go? Am I supposed to just keep going, or I couldn't really? I can't. I cannot go in there. Oh. Wait. No, this is where I came from. I <coughs> Excuse me. I can go to the bottom room, I guess, because it, it went downwards. Oh, 
Nope. <laughs> but it's not open. So can I go in there? Either I'm supposed to do something in the room I already was in, or I'm supposed to go somewhere else. I couldn't really find anything in that room. And I cannot go over there because I don't know how to... Let's go, let's go back first and see if there's anything I can do. Uh, oh, oh, the episode time, I forgot to keep shook on that. Uh, yeah, let's check out the room. And then if nothing happens... Uh, quarantine bay, everything is ruined. I killed the frog, so the virus thing. I can shoot, I can aim. I can duck and shoot. Can I? Oh yeah, I can duck and go like that. Okay. And I can jump. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> That's kind of cool. You can fire in almost any direction. Well, yeah, you can fire in all the. Well, can can you switch? Yeah, you can. You can jump and switch. Pew! Yeah, that's cool. Uh, so. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to end this first episode here. It was a lot of story and stuff. I guess the only choice I have is, is to go up in the really, really long room over there. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Goodbye!